Joining me now are Obama critics Jane Hampshire, the founder of FireDogLike.com, and Adam Green, co-founder of the Progressive Change Campaign Committee, and intrepid Obama defender Ed Rendell, the governor of Pennsylvania. Now, I just want to begin by saying, in, in, in political discussions and in political efforts, the biggest problems, and I think, uh, Governor, you, I, I wonder if you agree with me on this, the biggest problems you confront are always with your friends. Because your political enemies, the other side, the other party, they never disappoint you because you never expect anything from them. But it's trying to negotiate agreements with your friends within your own party about how to go forward that are incredibly difficult. And, and Jane, I want to I start with you. Uh, this, this is the president you supported, uh, Barack Obama, and you have been critical of him on health care and other policy issues uh, as his presidency has worn on. But I just want to establish at the outset, uh, do, do you do favor and support the Democrats in this congressional midterm election, don't you? Well, absolutely. And I, I don't actually think that the characterization of, you know, critics and defenders is accurate in this situation because we all really want the same thing. We want Democrats to turn out this fall and we want this, the campaigns to be a success. And as someone who, you know, every day tries to get people motivated to donate money, we raised $40,000 for Russ Feingold last week. We're operating phone banks into California, Arizona, South Dakota, uh, and Oregon over uh, marijuana measures, trying to get people out to vote. It gets difficult when they come back to you and they say, look, the president could be signing uh, a, you know, a way, don't ask, don't tell. Uh, uh, he, could, he could change it so that don't ask, don't tell discharges weren't happening right now. Himself, he doesn't need anybody else, no Congress, nobody else involved to do this. And he's not. Why isn't he doing that? And, and you have to answer that when people ask you these things. And that's why you say, look, President Obama, make it easier. Please do these things.